Hello, this is Nick with Hawkins Precision, and today I want to talk about M5 DBM, or Detachable Box Magazine Bottom Metals. We get a lot of questions about our DBMs, so I figured let's make a video describing the different options and different magazines that go with each. That way when you're specking out your next rifle build, you know exactly what to get. This information is also available at HawkinsPrecision.com in our blog section. There you can read over all about our bottom metals and which boxes and magazines and followers work with everything. It's all worth a good quick read if you're specking out a new rifle build. The first DBM I'm going to talk about is also our most popular. It's our M5 Short Action DBM. These are made for Remington 700s and custom clones in standard short action calibers such as 308 and 65 Creedmoor. These are made to work in single stack AICS magazines or double stack AW magazines. This is the bottom metal you want if you're running a 22 long rifle barreled action in the Remington 700 footprint as well. The short action DBMs come in two variations. First variation is for our AICS single stack 10 round or 5 round magazines. The second one is our AW latch version which has a little bit taller latch for folks running AW magazines or folks that are running Bagara, 22 long rifles, Voodoo's, or Rimaxes. Also 223's with polymer mags. You're going to want a little extra latch height for reliable feedings. So things to keep in mind, if you're running a 308, 65 Creedmoor, 6 Dasher, um, 6 BR, you're going to want the standard height AICS latch. If you're running this in your Bergara or your Rimex or you're running a 223 or you like to run AW magazines because they're a little bit shorter, you're going to want that AW latch version and get a little, little bit taller latch height for more reliable feeding. The next bottom metal in our lineup is our XM or medium length action bottom metal. These are designed for intermediate length cartridges like your 6.5 SOMs, your 7 SOMs, your 300 WSMs, or 6.5 PRCs with long heavy bullets. Uh, there's two versions of these. We have our Defiance version, which works with their XMs, and there's also a version that fits Lone Peak arms and still or medium length actions. You can pick up the Defiance version at any of our stocking dealers or at HawkinsPrecision.com. If you're looking for the Lone Peak version, you can call Lone Peak arms directly and pick that up. Uh, these are great options if you're looking to run heavy for caliber bullets and short magnums. They use MDT magazines or they use inflection design magazines. Uh, great option if you're looking to run, let's say, a 153 A-tip in your 6.5 PRC. Medium length action and a medium length bottom metal is a perfect fit. Next we're going to talk about our long action bottom metals. One thing to keep in mind about all the long action M5 DBMs is they all fit the same long action M5 inlet profile. So whether you're going to run the 300 Win Mag version or the CIP Plus version, it's all going to say be the same inlet, which saves some complexity when you're purchasing your stock. The first of those is our 300 Win Mag M5 DBM. These are made to run AICS part number 0479 for magazines with standard cartridge overall lengths for 300 Win Mags and 7 Rem Mags. They also work well with the appropriate magazine for a 30 out 6, a 270 Winchester, or any of those uh, standard bolt face long action calibers. Then we have our CIP length 338 bottom metal. These are designed to run AICS magazines with the part number 6715. This allows you to have cartridge overall length of 3715 for 338 Lapuas or 300 Normos. And lastly, our most popular bottom metal for long action calibers are CIP Plus. So keep in mind this will still work with those long action M5 inlets. It's just going to be more cartridge overall length, which isn't a bad thing. These are designed for 300 Normas, 338 Lapuas, 300 PRCs, 28 Nozzlers with those long and heavy bullets. They're designed to run the MDT 3.850 magazines or the Accurate 3.850 magazines. Cartridge overall length internal for those is 3.750 for Accurate and 3.760 for MDT magazines. So if you're looking for all the cartridge overall length you can get but still use a magazine, this is the bottom metal you're looking for and grab one of those MDT and Accurate mags and you're off and running. So I hope that was informational. There's some things to keep in mind about the bottom metal in general. These are made from a single piece of billet aluminum and hard anodized. 
They feature a paddle style magazine release for easy loading and unloading of your magazine. We also have an enlarged trigger guard for flat shoe triggers or wide shoe triggers. And the bottom metal does feature an integrated barricade stop. That way you can load into your rifle without tweaking the magazine and causing feeding issues. And that's the whole lineup. I hope you found, uh, found this helpful and informational. You can visit hawkinsprecision.com. Check out that blog to learn more about these bottom metals and the other bottom metals in our lineup. And we'll see everybody out at the range.